ragazzi, ben tutti e ben trovati sul mio canale, io sono Magnus e bene sì, ritorniamo sempre qui con Batman Tutto Serious Episodio Primo in italiano, ci tengo a precisare perché questo è con i sottotitoli ma in italiano veramente, spesso se ne trovano in italiano ma alla fine non sono in italiano, questo è veramente italiano, infatti sono contentissimo che vi sia piaciuto ed ecco per questo che ve la porto quindi passiamo col secondo episodio prima però di andare avanti ci dedichiamo come al solito ai saluti e partiamo in successione con Daniele Francesconi, Blue Eyes, Simone Ronzino, Gabriele Ronzino, Morelli, Edoardo 19, Nettuno 71 Bro, spero che questa avventura vi stia facendo Naturalmente come sapete il video come sapete mettere un po' in su un bel commento, un bel mi piace e continuiamo, vai! Guess I was wrong about you catching me. Not sure if it was for my sake or yours. Okay. Who put you up to this? Answer me or I let go. But you won't. You're not that kind of guy. Okay. I bet. <laughs> <laughs> Eh no. Step out of the shadows and be Bruce Wayne tonight. Oh, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Well then. Time to save the city. Mi sa di sì. Porca paletta, eh, ci ha anche fatto un bel graffietto. Dobbiamo stare Thank attenti. Grazie a tutti. Un uomo di distretto come me like non è abituato a un ringing endorsement. Anche uno che ha cut Gotham's crime rate in half. Per troppo long, questa città ha burned con corruzione e greed sotto la Mayor Hill's autorità. Ma vi promesso, you, un voto per Harvey Dent è un voto per finalmente mettere il tuo down. E insieme. We can stamp out the fire and save our great city. If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would sh Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late as always. Say hi, Bruce. Facciamo sempre i soliti antipatici, sì, vai. Enjoy drinking my wine. It's worth more than most of you. <laughs> no, he's, he's kidding everyone. <laughs> no wine is that expensive. Thank you. Thank you again everyone for your unwavering support. Together, we will change Gotham. Dobbiamo stare attenti a pure come rispondiamo Mr. perché Wayne. Cambia. Thank you for opening your house to us. Now I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. Just wanted to make an entrance. Congratulations, you almost missed it. You are a pillar of this city and my campaign. I need you here, tuxedoed and shaking hands. No one came here tonight to see me. Some champagne. I want to see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> And I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little face time with potential donors. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families again. Ah, a little liquid courage before facing your adoring public. This will help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. And now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. It always makes me sound like a used car salesman. Mm. Which, for the record, I have not been since... Ah, this is good. All right, all right, all right. How about, uh... Put a dent in crime, hmm? Look at you. It's not half bad. I'm gonna use that. Bruce, I meant what I said. 
Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can start with a few hands, hmm? Come on. Hmm. Casa abbastanza grande. Hi. Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to greatness. Well, thank you. But we're all here tonight because we want to make a difference. And that's what it's going to take. Every single one of us. Not just me, not just Mr. Dent. Everyone. Right, right. Of course. Old families like ours should flock together, you know. Like birds. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Oh, this city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall, that Cape Bat freak dealing out vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding golden age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save this city. And it's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. I'd say it all depends on the man. Sometimes uh, you need a person who will go off script. Such as dressing up in a bat costume? And taking out the criminals who ruin our city. Though the cape may be a bit much. <laughs> uh, don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. With Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne in the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city, oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway, it was terrible, truly terrible. A tragedy like that at such a young age it must have been crippling. If uh, only that uh, deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe... Uh, well, I don't like to think about maybes. And I'm sure you don't either. Well, Harvey is the one who's been behind the project since day one. A vote for him is a vote for the memory of my parents. Bravo. You'll have it. Thank you. Thank you both. Dobbiamo stare attenti, eh? Non saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. Hai visto? It is a night of ringing endorsements. Che sta musica? Oh, well, hello. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicky Vale. Not interested. And reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. Actually, I'm here for Mr. Wayne. Well, he certainly doesn't have any time either. Tonight is strictly off the record. We can talk, but nothing gets written down. I'm okay with that. I was just hoping to see what makes Bruce Wayne tick. This is quite the social event, Mr. Wayne. Oh, come on now, so formal. Call me Bruce. Well, oh. <laughs> Bruce, you've been going around pleasing everyone tonight. But how are you doing? You should enjoy your own party before all the champagne runs out. Just between us, politics bore the hell out of me. Too many words, <laughs> not enough action. Didn't think you were the type to get his hands dirty. Oh, you'd be surprised. Mr. Wayne, you've, you've got something on your collar. 
Um, is that blood? Yeah. It looks like... Uh, actually, it's, uh, it's lipstick. Well, no wonder you were late. Say no more. Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but, uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Ah, personal. Carmine Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything, except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, uh. Miss Vale. Oops. <laughs> and what kind of business do you think he's in? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham, for all of us. Look, at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. Jesus, Harvey, inviting a known criminal to your fundraiser doesn't exactly look good for your squeaky clean image. Uh, Let me worry about that. A word of warning, Bruce? Play nice. Noi sempre bene ci comportiamo. You know, I've been in the market for a new house. Decent walk-up, sky-high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. Though the decor offends my eyes. Oh, man, all flash, no class. Let's talk privately, shall we? Hey, <laughs> I like this guy. Ready to do business before we even introduce ourselves. But we'll get to that. Come on, Falcone. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. Che è questo rumorino? You're a respectable man, I hear. Bruce Wayne. I know who you are. The guy is going to sell me his house. Gentlemen, perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Follow me, if you will. You should know, Mr. Falcone, my analysts say we're raising triple what Mayor Hill had... Hey, what's... Private audience. Oh, come on, guys. Bruce? You'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Have a drink, have a talk. I'll bring Bruce back to you soon. We talk alone. Just you and me. Sorry, Harvey. Yeah, I'll, uh... I'll... Get a drink or something. Bravo. Ce ne occupiamo Christ. noi. Sei incazzato, eh? Yeah, well, that's just like Harvey, huh? Wants to make sure the rules are followed. But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just saying he will. The man talks too much, chaps my face with words. Unlike most people I've met, Harvey actually has integrity. He's trying to make Gotham a better place. So am I. So are you. Hey, we all carry this city on our broken backs. Might lighten the load if we do so together. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So, let's talk relationship. Ah, yeah. Chalk this for me. Be a pal. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat. Or I can pull it out from under him. Whatever happened to being a gracious host? Okay, imagine. This is me. And these are all my friends in Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. I make them all move. And I want to keep everything moving if Harvey gets elected. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home, hoping to make a new friend. 
One who can help Mr. Dent see the light, if need be. Between your businesses and mine, I bet we employ half the city. Now, we got a good thing going, so I don't see why we shouldn't team up. Yeah, that's not happening. Hey, this isn't a deal with the devil. You listen to me, kid. I know, somewhere inside that tuxedo, you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. And which to break. I think I'll have someone see you out. Bravo. Okay. Okay. So that's how it's gonna be. People don't say no to me. Not for long. Master Bruce, your guests are leaving. I recommend seeing them out. You wouldn't want to be rude. Uh. Heed your butler's advice, kid. Oh, and I'm no longer interested in buying the house. The owner's a prick. And he's gonna get what's coming to him. I shall face, huh? Ok, fantastico. Ok ragazzi, anche questa parte termina qui. Naturalmente vi ricordo sempre che in base a come rispondiamo l'evoluzione della storia può cambiare. Mi dispiace soltanto che in pratica ci sia un lasso di tempo breve per rispondere e quindi non si può ragionare molto ma bisogna agire d'impulso ma credo che sia fatto praticamente apposta detto questo naturalmente come al solito il video come sempre mettere un bel pollice in su un bel commento un bel piace fatemi sapere la vostra noi ci vediamo nel prossimo video e bye bye